For an indie animation lover like me, finding a new series, it can be so rewarding until I realize that it's been cancelled, which sucks, but it can't blame the creators, they could have stopped for personal reasons, that's what happens 90% of the time. But right now, I'd like to share with you my top 5 cancelled animation series. There's a few rules regarding this though. The series must be officially cancelled with little to no chance for a reboot or remake and it must be officially cancelled by the creator itself meaning that they'd have to put in a comments or an update video saying that they retired from the project. Okay now let's get started with top 5 cancelled indie animation series on YouTube. Punk and Cham and Pie is a story about two scarecrows. Well, a third character was going to be introduced, but it never even got that far. Only got about two episodes before Sparkflow Studios ended up dropping it. No apparent reason why, it just stopped over about a year or two ago. I can't fully remember when, but it looked really good for its time. A flash animated series with smooth animation completely looks frame by frame. Uh, the story never really kicked off, but it was entertaining to watch while it lasted. You should check it out if you have the chance. Not much I have to say about it other than the fact that you will be entertained. I actually had to do a bit of research about this one. No Man's Land, the animated series, is based off of comic of graphic novels. It was the story about John Parker, who was a sharpshooter in the Civil War. With a promising career, beautiful wife, and newborn son, but after being embroiled in a dark and demonic conspiracy engineered by the Bickerton Detective Agency, he lost everything. That's just the description for the comic, but I can only guess that that's where the series is going via flash animation. It start the project was started back in 2006, and I gotta say it looks pretty good for its time. It even has some horror elements, which if there's one thing I love, it's my horror. So it's really not long, so that's another thing you should check out if you had the time. I finally realized that I'm just going to tell y'all to watch everything on this list, but now I'm going to tell y'all my first uh, animated series that I found on YouTube, well indie animated series that is, that would be Kyblade. And this series is pretty awesome. It has its own kind of charm. The animation doesn't stand up well, but the voice acting is pretty great. And if that's not enough to get you into it, I'm not sure what will. There's plenty of action and stuff like that. The creator is now working on a new series called Eden. It looks really good and the animation is amazing. It'd be nice if he did a one shot of Kai Blade again just to see how, you know, give the fans how it looked to this day. But. One can only wish, huh? E Death Angel is a comic series by Alta Best Studio. Unfortunately, when they were adapted into anime, uh, the Kickstarter goal they went for was a bit too ambitious, if I can put myself out there. And as it went by, I was gonna provide some small funding to it myself, but I could see that. It really wasn't going to meet its goal, unfortunately. The trailer looks amazing though, and I really wanted it to succeed. But, although I never even got around to watch the comic, it still seems like an interesting concept. I'd suggest you read more about it because I really didn't have enough time to explain it to you now. But trust me, this is one that I'm really ashamed just didn't make it. What could possibly top this? Well... What can I possibly say about The Descendants other than it is downright amazing, even from a production standpoint. It was made entirely in GIMP, which is a free version of Photoshop, and has no elements of animation programming. Therefore, they must have had to do everything frame by frame, even the special effects within the uh, video. It's amazing what you can do with enough dedication. This first episode alone was over 10 minutes, and I gotta say, just wow. 
second episode unfortunately did it come it got a preview or two but unfortunately it was canceled but man just looking at this it's all text in the first episode so there's no voices whatsoever but if there's one series i wish could be brought back it'd definitely be this one but at least we got some kick-ass music out of it as well well this has been my top five canceled animation series unfortunately there is no uh honorable mentions due to the fact that there's not many animation series online on youtube but if there i find any more it'll be in another top five other canceled animation series well thanks for watching please like subscribe for more and if you have any suggestions for anything i should watch or anything i might have missed then please comment